I am Sagan. This is my wife, April. Isaiah, Killian, our male Rottweiler, Alistair, our female Stella, their pup, Arthur. We were headed towards buying a house, but decided to make a new turn in life. Join us as we travel and share our experiences, good or bad, of our full-time life on the road. So please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, hit the reminder bell, do not miss any upcoming videos, share with your friends, and thank you, we are U-Turn Permitted. This is our campfire campground review on Sherwood Forest here in Kissimmee, Florida. You come through the gate down here, the side's always open for let go, the side they have manned security. You come down in here, you pull in and you check in, and then you come into the RV park, which is on your left over here. They've got a beautiful little park area here if you want to just walk and enjoy and do the walk through the woods, I guess, at Sherwood Forest. One thing I want to say is I do see they have lots of poop stations for cleanup for dogs. At a lot of these encores, they have them around. And I just want to say thank you. That is appreciated from dog owners to have so many of them. Encores have been really good about having those just about everywhere. So I appreciate that. The park itself, it is a little packed. And being in peak season, we didn't get to choose our campsite because it is peak. But we got an all right one over there and it hasn't been too bad. A lot of helicopters. You hear a lot of helicopters, a lot of sirens. They got the helicopter tours just down the road. We are right off the main highway, right across from the the world's biggest orange um, so you do hear quite a bit of sirens and things in here and you do hear quite a bit of helicopters because the helicopter tour during the days um, they have this large chessboard over here got a nice half of basketball court here at Sherwood fenced in on one side well paved nice looking basketball court but they have a really nice about walkways some tricky tricky stuff on this one looks like and they got a nice dolphin over here but yeah interesting little loops up and drops down a whole bunch of interesting shots to be able to make look at that one it's got two drop off out of there Two holes up top, you can come up there and down. It's a nice little golf course they got. I like that they don't have um, bricks, that is all cemented around so nobody can knock things everywhere. And it's pretty clean and neat. Oh, somebody's missing on this one. There's a little putter guys over there. They each have their own little name. Bishop of London. That's the second hole, I guess. I guess this is your first. Right here with two little guys putting golf. And it has little trails you just follow all the way around. And it keeps going down and up. Go over and down. They've got a nice little playground area. If you got little ones that want to come and play. Decent little playground. And it's right next to the pool here. We'll go over in here and I'll show you in the pool area. Now the pool here is heated but it's not very heated so it's a bit chilly getting in and out if the sun's not on it um, but all in all it's all right pool goes seven feet deep three foot at the small end you can see it, this ends seven feet that feet ends four feet and three feet and they do have a hot tub over there oh pool is out of order today but this is the pool and over there in that corner they do got a hot tub Hot tub's not very deep. The hot tub has really got a lot of chlorine in it and it shows and it's not too warm. It's not at 104 so it's all right. It does the job but a little bit much chlorine in it like a little warmer so but that's just my personal opinion. They do have some bathrooms right here. Women and men. They're going through. No showers in these ones. Uh, the showers were a little dirty. This is sitting room. They do have a workout room. Is that the Lego guy? 
And this is the game room in here. So you got a couple of arcade, Super Saiyan games, a couple of Super Saiyan games. Good old Pac-Man. So we got table tennis in here. It's a little hard to see. It's a little dark. I don't know what it like though. I'll try that with you. Table tennis. You can play on Goro. Nice pool table. But you do got to go down over to cross the street. You go out here and cross over there to that building. So you check out everything. Pool cues, pool ball, everything like that. Um, oh, I love this. You have pool life. That is cool. That is way cool. They've got lots of shuffleboard courts if you like playing shuffleboard. Lots of shuffleboard. Hey guys, sorry it took me a minute to get a video up to you. Um, we left Sherwood and it's just been a hectic. I've been working quite a bit and everything. But anyways, I just wanted to leave with a review. We are giving Sherwood a five. Which is a good place we'd go get if we were in the area. It wasn't a bad park. We had a good time. We actually lucked out and didn't have anybody next to us. The people in the RV were gone. So besides that, we really didn't have any privacy. They do jam them in there kind of tight. Um, but the people at the park were friendly enough. Um, everything at the park was fairly clean besides the bathrooms. They needed to do a little upgrade on the bathrooms to fix those up. Um, Besides that, the park was good. We had a good time. And before passing through or in the area, we'd stay there again. Um, so go ahead and stay tuned. We've got some videos of us playing giant chess and mini golf here at the end of this. So enjoy. And as you can see, it's about that time of year. We got our Christmas tree up. So we'll have some more videos coming at you and hopefully not that far in between again. So until next time. If you're into playing large chest, oversized.
Oh.